So to understand how this happens, we have to understand two very, very simple terms, and that's force and mass. And this is a very simple concept where the mass always tries to follow the force. And the force in the baseball swing is the forward movement of our hands towards the ball. And the mass is the sweet spot of the bat. And if we understand that the mass is always trying to follow the force, then we can start to understand how to get on the perfect swing plane on every single pitch. Now this sounds a little more complicated than it is, and I have a really great illustration to explain how this works very, very simply. And I like to do this by laying the bat on the ground and simulating force and mass. And what we're gonna do is we're going to be pulling the bat along a fixed line, and we're gonna pay attention to what the mass does, or the sweet spot, in reaction to the force. So the most simple uh, version of this is laying the bat straight and pulling this, this bat along a fixed line and see that the mass follows directly with the force. Okay, so now how we begin to understand how it works in the baseball swing, we offset this barrel to the right, or at left, doesn't matter, and we're gonna pull the bat along the same line, or we're gonna pull the force along the same line, and we're gonna watch the mass work its way back to the, the same line that the force is pulling on, okay? So how do we get into that barrel below the hands position at contact, that, that ideal contact position, without trying to put the barrel down here? Now, this is where we add speed to the force and how we start to understand how that happens naturally. So if we place the bat back to the right of the line, and now I'm gonna pull the bat on the, along that same line, and I'm gonna add speed and we're gonna watch what happens to the mass, the sweet spot, when we add speed to the force. Okay, so now I pulled the force down that same line and you can see that the barrel whipped across the line. And this happens because the mass is attempting to follow the force along this line and because their speed, momentum is built in this direction and the, the, the weight of the momentum is pulling the bat across the line.